Hey, everybody, it's uh, Chris over at Dixieland Farm, and uh, you may be asking Chris, why is it called Dixieland Farm? I'll answer that. When we were looking for farms, we found this farm, and this farm was already uh, established. It was called Dixieland Farm, so we had the choice of renaming it or keeping the same name as the people went out of business and we bought their business. Um, you know, maybe the old people weren't any good. It'd be a bad thing. Or people would go, oh, yeah, 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 why don't you go ahead and check Dixieland Farm? And then they would look up in the phone book, uh, back when that was a thing, where people would look things up in a big book to find businesses. And that business wouldn't be there. So uh, we went with that. And that's why we're called Dixieland Farm. That's it. Only reason. So I got a box from Mono Price. Mono Price is a uh, company that sells cables. I am replacing my cables. Chris, you said cables don't matter. I never said that. I said that after a certain point, you're probably just hearing uh, subtle EQ changes in between the cables. Interesting story. So I've been reading a lot about uh, cables and this and that. And uh, some dude, I think it was on Audio Gone, he uh, had a very expensive cable. Very expensive. Um, and his cat got to it. Ripped it up. He was upset. Uh, he was more upset when he found out that that very expensive cable was actually just a garden hose from Home Depot. I guess he looked up uh, the SKU number. Uh, filled with sandblasting material and Home Depot wire. That was the only thing inside the cable. So, anyway, Monoprice are known for two things. One, having a very good pair of headphones, which I've got uh, squirreled away here somewhere. Um, they say even audiophile quality, which means uh, nothing. It just means they're good headphones. Uh, they cover the ear. They have a, a removable cord, which is nice. I find them a little dark. Um, I prefer my Grados. There you go. So, opinions differ on what sounds good and what doesn't. However, I, uh, the other thing they're known for are for very good cables at very cheap prices. Don't equate price with quality. These are known for being good cables and this cable here was three dollars. Again, rivals the monster brand in quality. Uh, I've read about these cables. They get very good reviews. They are made with 75 ohm video cable shielded. Uh, the connectors are I believe gold plated very good quality connectors, good cable, built better than I uh, could build them myself. Building yourself is always a great option, but these are cheaper than me even building them myself and perfect. More importantly, this is another reason to get them. It's really hard to find your 3.5 millimeter, otherwise known as eighth inch stereo to RCA in that thickness. So I've got going out of my phono preamp into a digital recorder and then out of the digital recorder into my uh, stereo system. I noticed no change in quality so that's why I've always got it in line. Also so that way I can always record anything that I'm playing instantly at 96 uh, 24 wave uncompressed. Uh, so I can you know, transfer it later and clean it up and do whatever I want. So all of these cables came. I'm not going to uh, put them on and say they're, they're amazing. You know, I just bought them. So I'm going to probably err on the side of saying, wow, they sound great. But that's it. I just wanted to show you the quality. So that's a six foot. And also, you know, very important is try to have them as short as you can. And three foots will probably do what I need. So that's why I bought a lot of uh, I think this is even 18 inches. I don't even think that's a, a three-footer. So, replacing my signal path with better quality cables. Always a good thing. Like I said, at a certain point, and where that point is, you don't know. All I could go on is reviews, what people have said about the build quality, did they have any trouble, what did they hear. Overall, that's it. What a boring video. It's about stupid cables again. All right, everybody. Bye.